Hi, welcome to binary search session. In the binary search, array should be in the shorted manner. Otherwise, we cannot apply the binary search. So, we are applying the binary search in the shorted array of integers. Uh, here, if our searching value is found, then we have to display the searching value uh, values index that searching value is found. Otherwise, we have to print the searching value is not found in the given array. The binary search is working uh, based upon the divide and uh, conquer strategy. That means it will divide the array into uh, two parts based upon the middle index. Then it will uh, it will it will compare uh, middle value is uh, less than the searching value. Then it will eliminate the first half of the array. So uh, if middle value is here. Uh, um, calculated by using the first index of the array 0, last index of the array is 9, then we will calculate so 4.5. So 4.5, so here um, uh, floor value is 4, so this will be taken as a, a middle value. So we will, uh, we will compare the searching value with the middle element. If middle element is lower than the searching value, we will eliminate the first half of the array. So first half of the array will be eliminated if searching value is greater than the middle value. And if our uh, searching value is uh, less than the middle value, that means middle value is uh, middle value is greater than the searching value, then what we will do, we will eliminate the uh, second half of the array. So that's what here given. So based upon that, we have to keep on repeat until the element is found or the entire array has been uh, checked and eliminated. So here the algorithm is given based upon the comparison of middle element and desired value. Uh, the example is given here. First we will calculate the middle element in the given array. So first, first index is 0, uh, so last index is 11, this one. So now we are calculating the middle element. So 0 plus 11 divided by 2 equal to 5.5. .5. So floor value is uh, 5. We will omit the uh, fractional part. So now the middle element is the uh, fifth location uh, here. We are comparing the target value, desired value is 22. 22 is greater than 21. So middle element is here lower than the searching value. Uh, so if it is the case, what we will do, we will eliminate the first half of the array. So now how we will do that elimination, we will update the first index of the array. So we will we will update the first uh, index of the array as middle element plus 1. So middle index is plus 1 and the middle index is here 5. So 5 plus 1 is the 6. So 6 is the first index now. Okay, first index is updated uh, as a middle plus 1. So now this is the first index, uh, last index and now we will calculate the uh, uh, middle index. Middle index will be 6 plus 11 divided by 2. So 17 divided by 2, so 8.5. So floor value will be considered. That is the middle index now. 8 is the middle index now. Now we are searching, uh, we are uh, comparing uh, target value 22 with the uh, middle element uh, uh, 62. So here searching value is less than the uh, so less than the given uh, uh, middle element. So if it is the case, we will omit this portion. So 22 will be in the left side of the 62. So we don't want the right side of the 62. So how do we do this? We will update the last index value by middle minus 1. So middle minus 1 will be the last index. Okay. So last, so middle is here 8. So 8 minus 1 will be 7. So 7 is your last index value now. So if you update the last index, automatically this portion will be omitted. So this portion is now ignored okay now again we are calculating the middle index from the first index 6 and 7 is the last index so 13 divided by 
two, so six point five. So six is the middle index now. So this is the middle index. Now we are comparing our uh, twenty two is the searching value and the middle element is also twenty two. So we can say element is found in the index number six. So we can stop the algorithm because if you found the uh, found the algorithm, we can return the middle element and you can stop the uh, algorithm. So now uh, one more example is here my target value is 11. I am checking with the uh, middle element. So middle element is calculated as usual. So 0 plus 11 divided by 2. So 5.5 .5. floor value is 5. So middle element is the uh, 5. So we are comparing 11 with the 21. So searching value is less than the 21. So uh, in the left side, left side of the 21, the 11 uh, may be available okay so we don't want the right side of the middle element okay so we are omitting the middle element by updating the last index value middle minus one last index now we are going to yes middle minus one so what is the middle index here middle index is five so five minus one will be four so four will be your last index now we are updating as yes, uh, uh, four so now here the 4 is the last index, uh, 0 is the first index, we are calculating the middle values, 0 plus 4 uh, by 2, so it will be the 2, so 2 will be your middle index, now we are checking 11 less than 8, so 11 less than 8 is, it is actually 11 will be greater than 8, so searching value is greater than the middle element, so we don't want left side, so 11 there is, there may be available uh, in the right side of the middle element, so we don't want the right side uh, left side of the middle element so we will update the first index as here uh, middle plus one so middle plus one here middle what is the middle middle is here two so middle is here two so two plus one is three so three is the first index now we update red right uh, three is the first index then uh, last index is same four so now we are calculating three plus four divided by two as the middle index so seven by two so three point five okay so three is the middle index now so this is the middle index now so we are checking 11 uh, 11 less than 10 so this is false so there is the possibility of 11 available uh, left side of the index so what we will do we will update the um, uh, first as a middle minus one so now we are going to update uh, first index uh, sorry last index okay last last index we are going to update uh, middle plus one middle plus one so three plus one equal to four so now we are updating the uh, um, first index right first index as a uh, here first index right so because here 11 is possibility in the right side of the 10 right side of the 10 so we are updating the first index so we are updating the first index first index is the middle plus one three plus one is four so now last index is already four so four plus four uh, divided by two is the middle index so it is four so now all indices are same all indices are same now we are checking 11 less than 4 now no it is not matching if it is not matching what we have to do 11 less than 4 so 11 may be possibility in the left side of the 14 left side of the 14 if left side of the 14 if it is available what we will do we will update the last index we will update the last index so last index will be equal to middle minus 1 so middle is now 4 4 minus 1 3 so last index is 3 so here we are checking first is uh, first should be always less than or equal to uh, less than last first should be always less than last but here first value is first index value is 4 right then last index value is now updated last index value is now updated that is 3 so 4 less than 3 right so look at that first index is uh, uh, 4 last index is 3 so this condition is false so we can stop the algorithm right based upon that uh, uh, code is given data we are passing the entire array so we are passing the length of the array is here 10 
uh, then value is i am i want to search the file we are first we are checking is it uh, sorted yes it is sorted now uh, first index is 0 yes then last index is length minus 1 10 minus 1 is 9 last index we are checking 0 less than or equal to 9 yes it is true if it is true we are calculating the middle index middle index is 0 plus 9 divided by 2 this is 4.5 so floor value is 4 so this will be your middle index okay this will be your middle index now uh, we are checking data of middle data of middle is 7 searching value is 5 so 7 less than 5 which is false if it is false then uh, else portion will execute we are checking 7 uh, equal that is middle of value 7 equal to uh, 5 5 is the searching value which is also false if it is false then we are updating the middle uh, last index with the uh, middle minus 1 so now uh, last index uh, initially last index is uh, 9 first index is 0 middle index is 4 now we are updating the last index here uh, middle minus 1 so this is going to be a last index so after updating uh, we are going to the next iteration so here we are checking uh, first is the 0 less than or equal to last index is now 3 yes uh, it is true if it is true we are calculating the middle index middle index is first index plus last index divided by 2 so here 1.5 so floor value is 1 so this is the middle index now we are checking uh, uh, the middle index is 1 so here data of middle so data of middle is 2 uh, less than of uh, uh, 2 less than uh, 5 okay searching value is 5 if it is the case we are updating the uh, first index first index will be middle plus 1 okay so middle is the uh, first index plus 1 so it is 2 now so first is updated now so first index is updated here this is 2 right so then we are going back next iteration in the next iteration here we are checking first index is updated now 2 last index is already it is 3 so now 2 less than or equal to 3 yes it is true now we are updating the middle index so 2 plus 3 by 2 equal to 2.5 so floor value is 2 so now uh, we are uh, checking data of middle so now which is the middle index 2 is the middle index okay so here the value in the middle is 3 less than searching value is 5 searching value is 5 okay so this is false if it is false then uh, else portion will execute so in the else portion data of middle what is the data of middle here data of middle is 3 equal to searching value is 5 which is also false right if it is false else else portion will execute here we are updating the last index with the middle minus 1 so what is the middle index here 2 so last will be 2 minus 1 equal to 1 okay so now last index is updated so last index will be 1 okay again going back in the while statement we are uh, checking here uh, with uh, uh, the first less than or equal to last so this is the condition first is here 2 less than or equal to last is now 1 so this condition is false if condition is while condition is false it will come out of the loop it will come out of the loop so we are checking the if condition here uh, first is here 2 greater than last index is 1 if it is the case we can say element is not found in the given array so this is the way to apply the binary search in the uh, using the uh, uh, middle element calculation here we are eliminating the half of the array at each iteration so uh, the time complexity will be order of log n or uh, here if uh, uh, if my element searching element is um, uh, 7 then you look at that uh, I, my length is 9 uh, sorry 10 uh, searching value is 7 uh, here I am uh, passing the array we are calculating 0 is the first index length minus 1 is the uh, last index now we are checking uh, 0 less than or equal to 9 yes it is true I am calculating the middle element uh, 0 plus 9 divided by 2 first index plus last index divided by 2 
so here 4.5 so floor value so 4 is the index middle value now we am checking data of middle is 7 less than searching value is 7 so it is false if it is false else block will execute so else block here 7 equal to 7 so if it is the case it is true if it is true it is returning the middle index middle index is now 4 right if middle index is 4 right we can break the execution that means no need to uh, proceed the execution we can stop the algorithm so here we are stopping the algorithm that our element is found then it will come out of the loop it will not go back for it while loop so here we are checking first index is here uh, 0 last index is here 9 okay so now we are checking first index is 0 greater than uh, 9 which is false if it is false it will not execute that means our element is found at the index number 7 thanks for watching